For those of you who are in the room in San Jose, you'll see we are running craps. You see on the right-hand system, that's A and B. That's the Kavari A and APU. We're running Battlefield 4 with our partners EA and DICE, 1920, 1080p, and medium settings. We're running flaps, flaps, excuse me, craps on the Intel Plus NVIDIA system. You see that in the lower right corner. That's on the left hand here in the room. So those of you on the web are seeing the Intel system, you're seeing about 10, 11, 12 frames per second. You can see some of the lagging. You can see that it's not smooth. It's not what we would consider meeting the, uh, the smooth gaming standard. Okay, so upon the webcast, and if you're in the room, we can now take our attention to the system on the right. Again, a single chip, Kavari A10, powering more than double the number of frame rates, a playable Battlefield 4 experience in 1920 by 1080 with a single chip. Also bear in mind, for those of you who are following the Battlefield 4 franchise closely, um, EA and DICE have announced that they will do a manual version of Battlefield 4. This is not that. So this experience is only going to get better. As you guys know, we continue to optimize the drivers up until launch partnering with EA and DICE on the Mantle version of games like this. So that's what we have to look forward to with Kaveri Lisa. Fantastic, JT. Thank you.